For the families of those fallen hotshots, this last month has been one of shock, grief, and support from each other and their surrounding communities. And nobody knows that better than Roxy Warnicky. The widow of the Marana area hotshot Billy Warnicky sat down with Not In Your Sides Maggie Vespa today to share her story. They had talked about the what ifs. When Billy was in Iraq, um, he had a, an IED blow up in front of him and his, and his unit. And one of the things that he always said was if he was to die, then he just wanted to die quickly. Billy Warnicky was a devoted husband. He would have made an even better dad. He would always check in on me. Did you take your walk today? Did you eat? What did you eat? Are you staying hydrated? How much water did you drink? <laughs> <laughs> but the former Marine's desire to be there for those in danger was unfading. He just said that one life is one life compared to maybe 10. And those are 10 lives that, that could have been prevented from being taken. Now Billy's courage helps his wife carry on. She has decided to name their daughter Billy yeah. Grace Warnicky. How are you feeling about the birth of your daughter, knowing that he would have wanted to be there? And that, is that going to be... What's that going to be like, do you think? It's months away. But. That was the, the most that I had feared out of anything else. I was just more afraid of, of doing it by myself, but my mom's going to be there, and I have the support of, of his family. They're going to be there. Roxy says little Billy will know her dad was a hero. She will know the sacrifice he made. She will know the story of a community that came together to comfort her family. Billy always put country and community first, so it has deeply touched me to see the community uh, pay tribute to all of his loved ones that were left behind. I'm Maggie Vespa reporting KGA 9 on your side. Billy Grace Warnicky is due in December. Mom and baby are healthy and they are grateful. They're grateful for you and your support, which was out in full force tonight.